Hey Ruby J Babes and welcome back to my channel. If you have not subscribed, why not? You need to subscribe so you can become a Riri J babe. I missed you guys. I know last week I did not post anything. I have just been really, really busy with work, with my self-care journey. And sometimes your self-care journey requires you to just like be quiet. I recently just blacked out my social media platforms, so well, Facebook and Instagram because I felt like it was just too much noise and while social media is a great thing when you're going through your self-care journey it is so important to listen to your heart listen to that small voice inside of you that's saying hey you know I don't like this listen to those little things that your body is trying to tell you to remove so what I did was I did block out my Instagram and my Facebook I did not delete them I put all of my pictures in archive and I just blacked it out um, I still have TikTok because TikTok is not as heavy. TikTok for me, I mean, at least for me, it's not. TikTok for me is very funny. It's a lot of comedy relief on TikTok and a lot of educational things that I find very easily. But it seemed like Facebook and Instagram is kind of turning into this negative space for me, even though I don't follow those kind of people. But today, guys, we are going to try out this new spot in Uptown Charlotte called The Monarch. So I'm about to start getting ready. So I want to give you an update on some of the Sephora items that I purchased just the other day because stay tuned. Don't mind my room, my bed. I'm doing laundry and washing my sheets and I'm also cleaning out my closet. So my bed is kind of crazy right now. But hey, so I'm gonna flat iron my hair. Before I do guys, I did my makeup off camera and I love it. So let me, okay, so first of all, this. This is the Sephora Velour Face Makeup Sponge. It's like a velour. That's where I put my concealer on. I use the L'Oreal Infallible Full Wear Concealer under my eye. And I use this to apply it. This is really good for applying under eye concealer. And I thought because it wasn't a sponge consistency, it was velour, that it might not evenly dis distribute the concealer. But this did really, really well with putting my concealer on. Here is my base. This is my... This is what I use as like a primer, girl. Black Girl Sunscreen, Make It Glow. This has jojoba oil and avocado. Then for my lip, I just put on Summer Friday, Vanilla Beige. I am in love with this stuff. It is, it smells so good. It's so creamy. Ugh. Girl. Mm. Black girl sunscreen as your primer. Infallible with the velour sponge. This blends out. I mean, I'm talking about like a filter. Like it really blends out your concealer pretty evenly, which is, I don't know. Anyway, we're about to go ahead and flat iron my hair. I've had this uh, flat iron for a long time. This is by Capozzi, and I got this from Walmart for like, I think 30 bucks. And when I tell y'all, this thing go up to 450, and when I say it really be 450 degrees, I wouldn't recommend using it on your natural hair because it could cause heat damage, but for your wigs, yes. Um, I feel really good, guys. I will give you guys an update of my self-care journey a little bit later, maybe at Monarch when I get there, but all I can say is, God is good. Y'all, God is so good. And, and and it's so true when God takes things away from you, it can hurt. It can be, there can be confusion. There can be, you know, pain behind that. But he's doing it for a good reason. Trust me, whenever God takes something from you, it's always to give you something better. And that is so true. Even though in that moment, you may not see that or feel it in that moment, it is true, okay? I also want to thank everybody who've watched my last video um, about the YouTube Brand Connect. Yeah, that's the new feature with YouTube. Um, I haven't seen any brands yet, but like I said, you got to be consistent, guys, on YouTube. Also, I had some people ask me how to create a YouTube page. Now, there's a lot of videos on YouTube about how to create a YouTube page, but I will post a video um, tutorial on how 
to create your YouTube page, how to customize your YouTube page. Really, YouTube is a big search engine. So just think about people really want to know information out here. Unless you're just a very entertaining person, nobody's going to want to see your daily vlog of you just walking your dog. <laughs> Unless you're just a, unless you're a celebrity or somebody who is just super entertaining, nobody's really going to just want to see that. So you have to not only find your passion, but you also have to link that with something that people are looking for. You also want to add some value. So yeah, you could do your vlog, but also find something that people are searching for and can get value from to add into your vlogs. You see what I'm saying? So you can just, if you're new, like, I mean, if you have like zero subscribers, Try to find uh, something that people are searching that you think you're good at, that you can teach or show to add value. Oh yeah, hair is done. And this is what I'm wearing guys to the Monarch. Comfy slippers. Very simple. I got this from H&M and then these pants I got from, I think Marshalls and yeah, they look cute. We're still rocking the iPhone 11 <laughs> to film, of course. My meditating phrase for last week was acceptance. So that means accepting my lifestyle. I took a break last week, got a lot of rest, a lot of time to myself, a lot of thinking, a lot of meditating on the word acceptance in every aspect of my life it's everything you know we're not living delulu over here okay So we are at Monarch. Um, it's actually really cute in here. It's like a food court and it has a bar. It has a nice passive bar um, up front and then it has like a nice little bar in the back where you have like, a sports bar where you can like watch sports. Um, it's super cute. So I'm about to order something. I don't know what I want to order but I'll figure something out. From, from what I'm seeing there's a lot of like, um, like burgers, like fast food type thing. Like, um, bar food type feel but yeah it's super cute it's a cute little hangout spot it's a cute hangout spot 
they got the game plan. It's nice. So anyway, I'll show you guys what I get when I get it and we will Thank you. 